are watching Jamaican News on YouTube, your number one place for local and international news about Jamaica. Now, remember to like the video, remember to share, comment, and subscribe to the channel for support and growth. With all of that said and all of that done, I'm going to jump into the intro, then I'm going to come back with one of my friends in. Welcome back my viewers and my subscribers. So right now my viewers and my subs, right now I may get some information right now coming out of Kingston, Jamaica. Where Fitz Bailey just, just, just right now my people announced in a press briefing where they find skeleton remain and they are actually, you know, in the process of conducting more investigation in finding out if this is actually the body of missing dancer artist Stephanie Williams, aka Medic. My viewers and my subs, right now we have an insert where I'm going to play a few for me to hear what Fitz Bailey actually say about the case. As you know, Medic has been missing for several months now, my viewers and my subs, from 2023. After she, you know, them say she actually went on a video shoot which was like a set up to get her out of her house and now my viewers and myself information reaching me right now is that they find skeleton remain a few days ago and after tests and thing they thought it is that of stephanie williams so make we hear what fitz bailey have to say right now on wednesday the 14th of february 2024 the skeletal remain of a body suspected to be that of Miss Stephanie Williams, O.C. Maddock, 29 years old, was found in a district known as Wallin in the parish of St. Catherine in a cane field. Miss Williams went missing on or about Thursday the 24th of August 2023 and has not been seen since. A missing person report was made to the Constance Spring Police by the mother of Miss Williams. As a result of the report, the police commenced investigation into a missing person and possible murder. Several lines of inquiries were made and several persons interviewed and statement recorded. It is also to be noted that several case conferences were held and significant support was given by the criminal investigation CIB headquarters in Kingston. The body will be processed and compared with DNA sample to determine the true identity. The investigation continues in the matter. I am appealing to anyone who may have information that can provide assistance to the police to call us at 119-311 and the nearest police station 